With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Well, hello students. Now we're going to see this question. The question says that a car without passengers is moving with a certain velocity on a level ground. It can be stopped at a distance of 10 meters. If passengers add 25% of its weight, okay, it's stopping distance for the same braking force and velocity is what? Okay, uh, so basically we have to find out the stopping distance. So basically the distance initially is uh, for the case one, let's suppose we name it case one. Okay, let's suppose there is a mass M. Okay. And what is happening? Force F is acting on the body. That means what the acceleration will be what? Acceleration will be F by M. Okay. So that's quite simple. And we have the S, the value of S as 10 meters. Okay. Now what we have to do that we will uh, assume that the velocity is V. Okay. And the initial velocity is V and final velocity. Let's suppose initial velocity is just we will consider u okay, and final velocity we will consider 0. So which equation of motion should we use? We, we should use the third equation of motion that is v square is equal to u square plus 2 into a into s. Okay. So from here what we will get? We will get the value that is uh, v square. Okay. So basically over here 0 will be equal to uh, basically u square plus 2 into a is what? a is f by m into s which is 10 okay so from here what we will get we'll get the value that is minus of u square must be equal to plus or basically 2 f or basically 20 f by m okay so we have this quantity now now what we'll do we'll use the case 2 so for case 2 so when we talk about case 2 the initial velocity will again be u acceleration basically acceleration now will become what the mass is now 25 percent more that means what m plus m by 4 because 25 percent is just m by 4 it will become 5 m by 4 okay that means what now what we have to do acceleration will be equal to f force will be same by mass is now 5 m by 4 okay so this will be the now uh, this will be the acceleration velocity is basically zero s we have to find out okay so u we will consider from this equation okay so basically now what we have to do is that now uh, we have to follow the for formula that is again v square is equal to u square plus 2 into a into s okay so finally what we will have v square will be equal to what if you see this will be uh, 0 okay u square will be what u square will be minus of 20 f by m okay minus 20 f by m okay and what we have to do plus 2 into a will be what 4f by 5m into s we have to find out so from here what we will have we will have over here is that 8f by 5m will be uh, into s will be equal to 20f by m okay so from here f and f f and m will get cancelled okay and we will have s will be equal to 20 by 8 into 5 okay so now what we'll do now we'll uh, find out by use uh, means uh, now we'll cancel it by 4 okay so this will be 2 this will give us 5 so this so this will come out to be 25 by 2 and finally what we'll have this answer will be 12.5 meters understood so when we check our options our answer will be clearly option number d that is 12.5 meters understood thank you for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.